Hey, what's up, Hotel Hotel family? This your brother Matthew Daniels, aka I'm Pooh, aka the Chosen Few, aka the real bookworm. I'm not a bookworm world. I'm the real bookworm. Make sure you get it right. And as always, may your name live on forever and may your memory never die. Remember that. Say it when you wake up. Say it before you go to sleep. May your name live on forever and may your memory never die. May the things that you are doing be so beneficial to those that come after you. They will remember your name and your works and your deeds for generations and generations to come. You live so righteously and upright. You did so much for those coming after you. May your name live on forever and may your memory never die. Hold tip. I want to give y'all a quick update. We got the Unity Summit coming. We got the Unity Summit coming right down here in Tech City, Texas. So what is a Unity Summit? What is a Unity Summit? Let me give you just a little background information. Let me give y'all a little background information. There's been a lot of violence here recently in Tech City, Texas, and Galveston County. So much so that um, a lot of the citizens, man, a lot of the citizens, not even a joke of matter, have, have been, been publicly talking about it, privately talking about it, and it is it's getting to the point to where it, it, it has to be addressed and brought and brought to an end. Right. And so um, we understand that in order to um, solve a problem such as this, you 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 need individuals to be a part of the solution that um, um, can offer um, multiple parts to the solution. Right. Because part of part of the solution may be like an economic solution. Right. We can try to look at the root cause of a lot of crime. And if we see that the root cause of a lot of crime is poverty, then we can try to institute programs and a system of getting people out of poverty so that the, the crimes will not be committed. There, there's a lot of things. So what we want to do with this Unity Summit, we want to come together with whoever in the area wants to come together and talk about peace, talk about unity, put it all on the table, or uh, um, actually get out there and show that there is more good than bad, right? There's more righteous than unrighteous. There are more people who want to live in harmony and peace than people who want to live like a savage. You know, there are more people who want to get up and go to work and come home and not worry about um, a straight bullet, right? Harming them with one of their loved ones. Right. It's some people who would prefer reality without that is more of them than it is of the people that would prefer reality like that. And if there are individuals in our community that has a mentality where they would prefer an, a, a, a lifestyle like that, then we need to reach, reach out to them um, as best we can. You see, as best we can and change and correct that mind state, because everyone will fare better. If everyone is working together, that is what the Unity Summit is about. My brother, Core Figure King White, y'all go subscribe to Core Figure TV. Um, he mentioned the idea to me. We uh, uh, went and spoke with the head of internal affairs for the Tech City Police Department, um, Officer Robert Wiley. We talked to him about it. And um, the, the, the three of us at that meeting um said that okay yes we're going to work together to make this unity summit come about and um from there we have been working to make it come about um we, we still need help we still need need able hands we want to have vendors out there um if you have something to vend you can bring it out there like my brother been saying this isn't in some kind of a hustle though we're really doing this to to, to, to highlight unity and peace and get the community on a on a on a on a on a right path, a, a safe path, right? But we 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 do want to allow the vendors to come out there and vent. Um, have some jumpy houses, you know, for the children. Have several speakers. Um, we're honored to say that our father, the great 
uh, Reverend James Edward Daniels has agreed to do the um, opening prayer um, when, when, we, when we begin the uh, Unity Summit. So we're still talking to people who want to actually come out and, and, and speak. Um, if they have something that, that they want to share, they, they can come out there and speak. Um, we also spoke with um, the head of Eternal Affairs. We spoke to him about actually having a police presence. We want to do this outside at a park, but having a, a police presence on the perimeter and having the individuals participating in the Un Unity Summit um, to, to make them feel even more safe um, because this is something that we are doing um, in conjunction with other entities, there are other entities around Texas City. There, there are people with positions here in Texas City that want unity and want peace, and we are trying to link up and work with them. And as we do, we, 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 we the, the event gets better. We don't have an actual date yet, but we're working on that. If you, if you want to support y'all, y'all can reach out to me. All of my information to reach out, support the Unity Summit will be in the descriptions um, of this video. Anything, anything can help. If you want to come out, that's cool. Um, I'm, I'm going to give you, yeah, watch my channel, watch my brother channel for the, the official updates on when it's actually going to be held. But before I go, that's primarily why I wanted to come, man. We want to see y'all at this Unity Summit. Um, we all know that this this is this is vital and crucial. I want to say something, man. Um, my brother and I, we we working hard to do this, you know, the right way. Do it, do it, do it legit. Do it how it's how it's supposed to be done, but get some actual serious results. That's why we that's why we making you know we, we we linking up with several other entities to bring them in and you know let, let let them speak, let them say something because this is a unity summit. We all need to come together. What what's more important than peace and unity? Once well, once we settle that, once 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 we once we get calm, then then you know we can move forward and economically advance everyone. Okay, everyone, because this Unity Summit is not only about holding the citizens accountable. Y'all know me. Y'all y'all know my brother. Just think of it. Whether we're saying it, whether we say it or not, y'all already know what we're always about. We uh, Accountability across the board. We're also talking about accountability in City Hall. We're also talking about accountability in the police department. That hasn't changed because we're dealing with internal affairs. We're dealing with internal affairs. You understand what I'm saying? So it's accountability across the board. We talk, we're talking about unity. All foolishness must stop. It's not just the, the community, but all foolishness must stop. Okay? Y'all, 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 y'all understand we need y'all to show up and show that support, man. This is um this this is big. This is big. The time is now. They will be uh they will be at one point they will be saying when you're older, especially if you're from around this area, where were you when the when the Unity Summit took place? I'm throwing it out there for you. They're going to say, where were you? May your name live on forever and may your memory never die. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Come on. Come on out. Come on out. May your name live on forever. May your memory never die. It's only one. It's only one outcome, family. It's only one outcome, family. You, you see what I'm saying? better for for everybody on the other side it's the only outcome it's, it's better it's gonna get better watch watch come on show that support may your name live on forever and may your memory never die but always a good way to support it why do i call myself the real bookworm y'all know why i call myself the real bookworm because not only do i read the library i pull out over 600 books but I write, and I love when people support. You know, I love when people support. First, you can get all of my novels at dandyandbigherm.com. Link will be in the description. Go read the synopsis, uh, uh, show your support, purchase the books. They're also all available um, on Amazon. Just search it by the book title. Like this one, Suicide Note. Search it by Suicide Note by Matthew Daniels, and it'll pop up on Amazon. So we got Suicide Note. Go, man, go, go. If you want to support the Unity Summit and you have no other way to support the Unity Summit, just go buy one of the books because it's, we, we need finances as well to, to, to do some of the things that we're doing down here. It's, it's, it's bigger things on the plate than the Unity Summit. The Unity Summit is major. That's what we need to do right now. But there, there are more things going on, and those things take finances. And want a good way to support financially, purchase, purchase the book. I'm going to do what I'm supposed to do with the proceeds. I'm not just trying to get rich off book. I'm just, I'm, I'm just trying to have a, 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 a le, legit, legitimate way to feed my family while, while I put in the work. 
You know what I mean? While I put it in the work, all right? I'm, I'm, you know, I'm an author. I write anyway. I want to write. You know what I mean? So I can be pushing out these books. I can be compensated for the books I'm putting out. It put in more work and more work and more work like these Unity Summers. But y'all go get that Suicide Note by Matthew Daniels. All right? It's on dandyandbigherm.com. Also available on Amazon.com, BarnesandNobles.com, Walmart.com. We everywhere. Um, you got Thicker Than Water by Matthew Daniels. This and Suicide Note. They're urban fiction novels. Okay, you got Thicker Than Water by Matthew Daniels, available at dandyandbigherm.com. Also available at amazon.com, walmart.com, barnesandnobles.com. It is what it is, and the infamous big game hunting. If you're here for the Unity Summit, you got to know about the big game hunting, big game hunting documents from 2010 to like 2016, but I wrote it in 2000, around 2019, 2020, so I have some up-to-date information, but I'm primarily focused on 2010 to 2016 when me and my brother were building up to the events that you're kind of seeing right now. What you're seeing right now with the Unity Summit, I lie to you not, we're living Big Game Hunting Volume 2. For real, for real. See how I say Big Game Hunting Volume 1? Okay, we're live, literally living Big Game Hunt Volume 2 is being written in real life. The Unity Summit will be in Big Game Hunt Volume 2. That's what I'm saying about may your name live on forever and may your memory never die. Come on, show, show, show that little... It, History's lived for a thousand years, man. That's why I'm in. I'm the official scribe, minister of information. I'm telling you, I'm the real bookworm. These things can last for a thousand years. Where were you? May your name live on forever and may your memory never die. That's the reason that I'm saying it. I want y'all to catch on. Just get some of this with me because I'm I'm getting it. My brother, hey, we doing it, man. What are you what are you leaving for the generations that come after you? That's what it's about, man. You leave something for the generations that come after you, man. And they leave something for the generations that come after them. And it's better and better and better and better and better. That that's what it is. You know, big game hunting. No big game hunting. Y'all get that available at dandyandbigherm.com. You feel me? And my latest, my beautiful and loving wife by Matthew Daniels. Available at dandyandbigherm and Amazon.com. Right? Greatest love story ever written. I wrote it for my wife's birthday. I presented it to her on our anniversary because I finished it fast. About three years ago, she told me I wasn't romantic, family. She said the real bookworm wasn't romantic. Why? Because I really don't like to do nothing. I'm not going to lie to y'all. I really don't like to do nothing. Hey, hey, Matt, a.k.a. the real bookworm, you want to go out to go do this? No. You want to go out to go do this? No. You want to go see this? No. You want to go see that? No. Do you want to try this? No. Do you want to try it? Well, what do you want to do? I want to just sit, read, write, study, research. I just want to chillax. That's all, that's all I want to do. You feel me? That's that's just all I want to do. Oh, but I'm not romantic. Okay, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Pump your brakes, little mama. Pump your brakes, wifey. I'm not romantic. I tell you what, I'll become one of the most romantic men in history by doing something that few scribes, if any, have ever attempted and or successfully done. Wrote a whole volume. To their significant other, the love story of the love story of all time. It's the greatest love story ever lived. So it's the greatest love story ever written. And you know, like just like a big game hunting, real event. I took our life, you no know, my real my real life, my real feelings, my real feelings for my wife, and I put I put it down. Look, I'm gonna read the back of this one to y'all, just so y'all can get a glimpse of how deep the real bookworm can go. I go deep, family, the greatest love story of all time. Check out this synopsis, I gotta read this one. There are some things in life which are so impactful to us that we wish we could scream it from the top of the highest mountain. And we would imagine some force, being, or entity grabbing hold of our cries out into the heavens and carrying them on throughout the vastness of existence for all eternity. So that anyone a million miles away, a million galaxies away, or even a million years away will be able to hear you proclaim whatever event caused you such great joy that you shouted it from the top of a mountain in the first place. And so this, my dear wife, and all who will one day read these words, this is me, Matthew James Daniels, standing on top of the highest mountain that I could find, and with all of my energy, strength, being, and will, shouting out into the stars, to people that I will never meet, never see, never hear, and never touch. People that I will never laugh with, joke with, or have a conversation with. I am shouting out to you how I feel about my beautiful and loving wife, 
so that a time will not come when this is not remembered and spoken of. May daughters be named after you and songs be inspired by you. This, Raquel, is my gift to you for being such an amazing gift to me. Happy 30th birthday to you, my beautiful and loving wife. May her name live on forever and may her memory never die. Y'all show up to that Unity Summit. Y'all get those books. Y'all support. We doing something that you ain't never seen be done before. This your brother Matthew Daniels, a.k.a. Apu, a.k.a. The Chosen Few, a.k.a. The real bookworm. I'm not a bookworm world. I'm the real bookworm. Make sure you get it right. And as always, may your name live on forever. And may your memory never die. Hotel family, I'm going to get with y'all.